Alrighty guys, it's been a while since I've done a video, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, do one tonight and uh, upload it for you guys. Uh, is it, uh, I wanted to discuss a couple of things tonight uh, about the uh, uh, impending uh, decision on whether they're going to do a quantitative easing number three or call it something else. Um, a couple of things that I wanted you to be aware of um, is, is that, um, first of all, when the if the Fed decides to uh, do some quantitative easing uh, or call it whatever they they like to call it, uh, there's going to be a move up in the uh, paper silver market as far as the spot prices that we currently all base our silver off of. Um, I also uh, think and believe and would speculate that if the uh, quantitative easing three or whatever they decide to call it doesn't happen in the uh, short term, look for a price pullback in the uh, paper market. Um, if that does happen, it could be an excellent buying opportunity uh, as silver and gold are always going to be uh, 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 a safe haven for, uh, for us and all those who choose to uh, convert some of their dollars into paper, uh, their dollars into silver rather I'd say. Um, so just keep an eye out for that. Uh, I recently during the dip picked up this uh, 10 sheets you're seeing me uh, scroll back and forth on. Um, I picked this up for just under $400. Um, uh, 10, 10 uh, silver Canadian uh, maple leaves, 1992s. Um, at that age and still in the sheet, had to go ahead and pick it up. There's one that's been tested uh, through the plastic, as you can see. Um, that's what the little mark is. Um, looks like they took a needle and stuck it in there and tested it. And it tested out fine. Um, so everything works here. Um, so I don't know how much of a value that knocks that down, but I don't think it's going to hurt. Um, well, go ahead. Please comment. Please subscribe. Uh, I'm more interested in hearing what you guys think is gonna gonna happen uh, with the uh, decisions that are coming at the end of this June with quantitative easing two stops. Um, uh, would I be? I believe that I would be correct in uh, making that uh, argument that if they do nothing in the short term, we're going to see a pullback in the uh, paper market. And if they do, we're just going to see a continuous rise in price. So be aware of the move up right now. Uh, be a good thing could be a bad thing, depending on what happens for us that's mostly just playing in the silver market and not hedging anywhere else. Um, be a little cautious. Um, always do your own homework. Take a look at things and look at the last pullbacks uh, before the quantitative reason started and uh, kind of gauge and see where things are going to be. Well, I'm going to go ahead and have a good night. Um, this is just a quick video for the young guns and everybody out there. Uh, yeah, subscribe to the channel. Uh, please comment. Please rate, like I said before. Have a good night.